Thank you. Um, so uh, I, I'm, I'm not sure how many folks here know about uh, energy efficiency, renewable energy. We're the applied R&D uh, arm of the Department of Energy, uh, dealing with 10 different technologies, but, uh, but basically the technologies you see represented around, around you here today. Uh, I think every one of them, including, uh, we have a few, you know, a booth or two here uh, from some of our direct offices. Um, so we, we've been working on these technologies now for well over 20 years, and, and it's great to actually hear uh, from a few of the branches of the services uh, that demonstrating that these things are actually here today and are being deployed on the ground and uh, are being uh, have been effective for them. And I think that that's, that's actually the, the story that, that we want to tell about uh, renewable energy and energy efficiency today. We've moved from a sort of a basic research uh, facility into, into much more of a real-time commercial integrated uh, off-the-fly R&D shop. You know, our technologies are in the commercial marketplace, and you can see a lot of them around here today. Uh, today, and, um, and so we're not talking about uh, you know, five, ten years down the road, although the future is very bright five years and ten years down the road. Uh, we're talking about uh, really today. And I think that's, uh, that's the message that I think you'll, you'll hear throughout the day today. Um, and, and in that context, we view at EERE, one of our primary objectives is helping the United States win what we think of as one of the most important global economic development opportunities uh, of the 21st century. This, this clean energy race is not just here in the United States, it's across the globe. Uh, it has taken hold in not, not just the developed world, but the developing world, and it is a, a powerful economic driver. Nearly $270 billion we saw invested last year in clean energy. Uh, we see continuing to multiply off into, off into the future. And uh, I think one of, one of the most incredible uh, economic opportunities, as well as environmental opportunities, uh, that we're, uh, we're looking at um, in, the, in the near future. Um, and, and this is really a product of largely American innovations. And, and so part of our role, we see, and I think that the uh, branches and services uh, exemplify that, is capturing that value and keeping it here in the United States. So that is why uh, we have we have stayed uh, focused on manufacturing of these technologies as well as the, the lab-based research and development, and why we why we have been involved uh, in large measure in the deployment space. Um, so I, I have two points. I mean, we pause a little bit. I don't really need to sell you on that. I, I did want to throw out a few facts that uh, that we looked up looked up recently, just to kind of give you a sense. Um, so, one uh, in, in the 12 months ending in uh, October 2013, the U.S. derived now six percent of its net power generation from renewable sources, and it, you know, a growth of and it was five percent the year before. Now, one percent doesn't sound but 1% year-on-year growth in, in, a, in a large economy like, like we have in the United States is an incredible amount. Uh, and so, and you'll see that when you, you know, part of the reason for that is the cost of a PV model, for example, has dropped from $3.40 3 a watt in 2008 to $0.80 a watt in 2013, making it great competitive as, as, as it just, was just stated. Now this is not merely, uh, you know, this is not a decision to, to do good for the best of society. It can be a decision to do an economic good in the near term for, for your installation. Uh, one, another, another stat is since 2008, total U.S. solar PV deployment, the development has jumped about 10 times from 735 megawatts to 7.2 gigawatts uh, of development. It's a really amazing, amazing number. And at the same time, wind power capacity is more than tripled in the United States. Um, as I think you'll probably see over here, uh, on the efficiency front, LED bulbs that only a few years ago were $50 a bulb and now dropped to under $10 a bulb, making, them, making their payback periods less than, less than a few years. Uh, 
providing, you know, in the case of an LED, better light than, than you could have had before. You know, something that will last now 20, 25 years. It, really uh, an incredible technology story across the board. I, I now see some, some members come in. So let's, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wrap up here and, and, uh, and, and talk and, and make sure we can uh, get other people involved. But um, I want to thank everyone for, um, for coming out and for being a part of this exciting industry. Uh, it's, you know, it's, a, it's been a tremendous challenge, but it's, it's, an, it's I think, the most exciting opportunity that, uh, that is out there today. Thanks very much. Thank you.